have no welcome back, welcome back, welcome back, welcome back in the kitchen to Chef Ricard. I'm going to make a garlic steak today and I'm just going to make it very simple and easy and effective. First of all, I must say I have some garlic. I got roughly about four cloves of one, two, three, four cloves of garlic. Um, I'm going to be cutting up the garlic, put on it. But first of all, I want to introduce to my Jamaican Valley season, which I'm going to be using to marinate it. I'm going to be using the all purpose season and the jerk season. All right? So, first thing, let's get the. This is the all purpose season, and I'm using only one piece of steak. I'm going to be popping on one teaspoon of the all purpose season. Let's put a little bit more of the all purpose season on it. All right, second thing, I got some jerk seasoning from the Jamaican body. And remember, if you want to get your Jamaican body season, guys, please visit their website www.jamaicavalley.com. And also, you can use my code, Shepherd. C A G F R I C one two three all lower cap. I'm gonna put on a teaspoon of the jerk season. Nice one. Let's put this at the side. See them right here. Then we're going to get the garlic because remember it's a garlic pan fry steak we're gonna do right now, and this can serve with anything you like. So we're just gonna show you how you can do your steak so basically I'm just cutting up my garlic nice one so that's the garlic and as you can see I'm on the garlic I put on it you don't need to worry yourself the only thing I want to say to my fans is you might just say Chef Ricardo you're not gonna put no more season on anything in it I'm just gonna be leaving it just like that because the Jamaican body season got everything. I'm gonna put on uh, roughly a teaspoon of olive oil. The Jamaican body season got everything in it. Also, you got the thyme, you got every little bits and pieces that you can think of. So what I'm going to do is just marinate it up like this. Rub up the all of the season on it. And the garlic, because it's a garlic pan fried steak. All right, so basically you're supposed to, to see a lot of garlic. So what I'm going to do, I'm gonna be simple putting down my steak for roughly about two and a half hour for it to soak then after two and a half hour then we're going to fry it all right guys so let's get the steak soak for about two and a half hours and then after we will fry it thank you so much for watching chef for the show got a lot more recipe and a lot more ideas nice and lovely look at that Nice and lovely guys, so basically, I soaked my steak for roughly about two hours and a half. So what I'm going to do, I just put on a medium sized fry pan on the stove. A little bit warm. I'm going to be pan frying the steak now. I put it in like this. You notice I didn't put the garlic, no oil. Because the steak already have a lot of oil. So what I'm going to do, is take my little time and fry it just like that. It's pan fry steak, you don't need to rush it. Nice and lovely. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna pop it over to the other side. I'm gonna put a little bit more heat. Not too high, medium sized heat. I'm gonna fry it for about five to six minutes. Nice and lovely. So guys, this is what exactly I'm talking about. So you don't want to overcook the steak too much. So this is just perfect garlic pan fry steak. So this, now you can just shear it out 
whatever you like to share to be done with the rice or vegetable, whatever you like to have it with, guys. So hopefully you like the recipe and please subscribe. It's a very simple recipe and the show my fans them exactly what they can do at home. All right, guys. So what we're going to do, I'm gonna just simply dish it out on a plate and make the fans them see exactly what I'm talking about. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching Chef Ricardo Show. We've got a lot more recipe and a lot more ideas to come your way. All right. So that is finished. I'm gonna share it out. And hopefully, you guys, will love it.